Hey guys, we're headed over to the Neutral Zone, which is a local store here in town that has uh, U of L stuff and U of K stuff. They ordered another one of the great big pieces that I do. They sold one, so we're going to deliver this over to the Neutral Zone. Right, today's shipping day this is uh the big seven foot by three foot custom box we are uh, gonna ship a couple big pieces to lake havasu it was a 12 piece order from a very nice young man um he would like that that i said a young man but it's orville in lake havasu and we had to get custom box because these pieces are seven foot long we're gonna ship two of them we're gonna show you how we get these packaged up safe here is the first piece this one's going to Lake Havasu this is the first piece we're going to pack two pieces in this package here we got to get some bubble wrap I put a layer of bubble wrap on the bottom we're going to cover this in a big old quilt lay it down we'll do the same to the other piece lay it down and fill the box with uh, some stuffing or just whatever it takes to fill the box so the pieces can't move around in them Okay, here's the first pieces in there, and as you can see, we have to package these things like crazy. You just have to, even though we're shipping FedEx, we still have to expect them to throw this box around. Uh, you have to pretty much pack these pieces like you would some eggs. It's ridiculous, but it is what it is. So we're getting her done. That's the first piece. Now we're going to get the second piece in there. This is the next big piece that's got to go in the box. Uh, this is about as big as wall pieces as we make. This is like seven foot. I mean, I can do them twice as big if you want them. But as far as shipping and stuff goes, this is about the size we like to ship for, uh, for larger homes above your couches and stuff. Beautiful piece. I absolutely love this piece. Tons of color. It's got to go in the box, though. So let's get it in there. Okay, once again, we got Miss Marla, and that is Miss Marla, I said. She's here at the studio to pick up some stuff and take it out to a couple of the uh, fan outfitters and a couple of the neutral zones. She's got to drop off some pieces today that they ordered. So uh, tell us what's new for St. James this year. What's new for St. James this year with Biscardi Designs are the splatter paintings with um, the brushed aluminum framing. And they are awesome. You've got to see these. Now, they're not completely ready yet, but I'm going to show you a couple of my favorites. All right. Let's see what you got here. Okay. So, cool. So, these actually have uh, a frame on them when we're done with them. Yes. I have a brushed aluminum frame that will probably go about an inch in and, and just different crazy designs. They've been yet to be determined, the designs. They really it. have. It's, <laughs> it's, uh, we'll it's, uh, it's all up to the artist. Show us that brown one back there. I okay, love that this one. This one is my personal favorite. I hear you actually threw a couple of the splatters in that one with with Biscotti. I did. Do you see the white? Do you see the white on here? Yes. I did that. That's awesome. <laughs> tell me about the tell me about the shiny stuff. What do we call that? That is diamond dust. Diamond dust. Ho ho ho! It makes the paint. It makes the paintings uh, really sparkly. Check this and out. We'll go. In, we'll go in close up, and you can see. This is what we call, it's not glitter, people. It is diamond dust. Awesome. And here's a couple of the other ones over here. This one here has some different color schemes in it. And let, hold that one up, too. Everybody loves the Florida leaves. This is a new one. This That's, will be a fan favorite for sure. Yep, yeah, especially in Louisville, right? Yes, especially in Louisville. It's one of our symbols that we use fan. in the uh, Kentucky logo. And the police officers have it on their sleeves. And... Uh, this is a real popular design right now, so I'm sure that one will fly off the shelves when we got a frame on it. All right, Miss Marla, we'll see you again next time. Tell everybody bye. Bye.